Hello everyone. My name is Ruba Sri. I am final year student of EC department studying at Sri Venkateshwara College of Technology and here we are going to learn about the topic called VSAT. VSAT normally stands for very small aperture terminal. VSAT provides one way or two way broadcasting point to point voice services and one way video broadcasting services. Vcast is nothing Vsat is nothing but uh, it is a data broadcasting from point to point services it is a centralized network with a central host and a number of geographical dispersed terminals uh, and this uh, in this video, in this diagram we will see that uh, it is connected to a it has a ground station and uh, in the ground station hub uh, hub earth station and uh, in the opposite it has a vsat terminal in the hub station it has various kinds of uh, terminals and uh, base equipment rf terminal and video studio facilities in this uh, the host will give a data to the base station equipment and the server will also give this data and voice and we will receive a video or a broad video or an audio broadcast through this in this outdoor unit vsat has outdoor unit and it has an indoor unit in this we can see that a voice data is can be transmitted vsat is very helpful in this uh, it has a different segments it has a ground segment and a space segment a ground segment is a very high performance nothing but an hub earth station and a large number of low performance terminal to the vsat and a space station which is a geo satellite acting as a communication link between the hub station and the vsat in this uh, the vsat is a high performance which is a small sized earth station used to transmit and receive a data or a voice or a video signal over a satellite communication network excluding uh, broadcast television vsat is uh, widely used and uh, in this the rf terminal the rf terminal is uh, compressing of an lna lna is nothing but a low noise amplifier which gives a reception and a base equipment and it will convert uh, the signals into an upper counter upper converter and a power amplifier is a uh, used for uplinking the bidirectional network whether it can receive and it can uh, transmit and it uh, employs with a c band or a ku band generally it carries a digital signal and it uses uh, different types of modulations in this uh, it uses two types of modulation one is binary phase shift keying and the other one is quadrature phase shift keying modulation schemes in this uh, it will uh, check whether the forward error correction is using wetter b or uh, decoding techniques are used with this types of modulations and the hub station hub station is the earth station the earth station consists of an outdoor antenna for transmission and an rf signal and a baseband equipment comprising modems and multiplexes and encoders it controls it has a control center for managing networks and interacting equipments and then advantages of vsat uh, by using a uh, vsat uh, we can cover a large uh, wide uh, geographical areas and it is highly reliable and uh, independent of terrestrial communication infrastructure it is very flexible to use and the disadvantages are it is very um, uh, the startup uh, cost is very ex expensive and uh, it is it has a delay of 500 milliseconds because uh, from the geo station and to the earth ground station it delays 500 milliseconds for each round and it is a dis disadvantage and the environmental conditions can affect the vsat transmission and uh, reception applications uh, of this vsat it is used in uh, VOIP it is nothing but voice over internet protocol or video or uh, remote location in this uh, we can submit uh, sorry we can transmit and report 
the voice and video calls and it is used in many campings ships at the sea receiving um, satellites and emergency response oil gas and etc thank you for uh, listening this uh, video and uh, subscribe to the channel thank you